Welcome everybody, this is your boy Joanna Martello and me here with another Grand Theft Auto VPC modding tutorials. Like always, if you like this video, smash that like button and if you're new here, subscribe for more daily gaming content and we're gonna get straight into the video. Welcome back guys, this video is all about on how to install YMAP inside your Grand Theft Auto V folders. So like always guys, make sure you download all of the requirements that's inside my description below and make sure that the, the requirements is the latest version. Once you guys completed that, then I will leave the YMAP files inside my description below. Once you guys have downloaded this, okay, then we're gonna get straight into it, okay? Now, to install Wayne Map, okay, into your Grand Theft Auto V folder, is that you gotta go to your Grand Theft Auto V game, hover over it, right click, and open file location. Make sure you guys do install all the requirements first, and make sure you connect Open IV. Once you guys have connected Open IV and install all the requirements, then make sure you got a mod folder. Open up your mod folder. Go into your update folder. Go to time 64. Go to DRC packs. And now open up your YMAP files extract folder. And inside the extract folder, there's another YMAP files folder. And now inside that folder, we've got a few files here. Click on custom maps and drag it inside your DRC packs folder. Then click on readme.txt and copy the DRC list line. Now exit out of your text file, exit out of your extract folder, go to your Grand Theft Auto V main folder, right click and refresh your folder. Exit out of your game folder and go to your open IV. Go to Grand Theft Auto V Windows. This process will take a few seconds. It depends on your PC performance. Once your open IV has opened, go to edit mode. Select yes. Go to mods folder. Go to updates. Go to update.rpf. Go to common, go to data, then scroll right down the bottom, and you'll see drclist.xml. Hover over it, right click, and select edit. Scroll right down the bottom until you go to the last path, and click on items on the side, press enter once, and then paste your code right there. Make sure you save the code. Go back to drclist.xml and double check to see if the code is still there. And yes it is. Exit out of your application. Now guys, what we are going to do, okay, is that we are going to install a wire map, okay? So go to your GTA V. This is a tow truck garage, okay? And this garage does spawn as Y map okay I will give you guys a demonstration okay um, what I have already downloaded the mod so I don't need to download it all you guys got to do okay to install the Y map mod go to your mod folder go to update go to time 64 go to DLC packs go to custom maps go to DLC.rpf go to time 64 Go to levels, go to GTA 5, go to city, go to maps, go to custom maps.rpf. And now, whatever file that is in there, just delete it. Now, over here is my tow truck garage wine map. All I gotta do now, guys, is just drag it inside here, and that's it. That's all you guys gotta do, okay? And then now uh, go back to GTA V, go to edit mode, and then exit out of your open IV, 
right click and refresh your desktop and I'll see you guys in the game welcome back guys okay the reason why I had started early because I want to show you guys and give you guys proof that I'm not spawning any map mods okay so what I'm gonna do guys is that I'm gonna go and skim through this okay so I'm here with Franklin and like always guys the reason why I started early because so you guys can see that I'm not cheating and I'm not spawning any map mods okay so I just came in the game recently guys and I haven't spawned any map mods I didn't use a menu or I didn't use map editor okay guys see I'm not spawning any map mods okay so what I'm gonna do guys is that I'm gonna go and come over here I think the map mod is over here somewhere I think it's over here I think it's over here oh, so yeah uh, so we're gonna go and teleport there and see what it looks like now here it goes guys so you guys saw me coming into this um, session without spawning the map one okay so what I'm gonna do guys is that I'm gonna turn around and see whether if it's there okay so in five four three two one and there it goes guys see I didn't spawn it there um, it just it just spawned there like automatically it's really really awesome guys so what we're gonna do is that we're gonna spawn a vehicle and pretend that we are the owner as well which we are the owner but yes I'm just gonna go and drive a car in there so what can you so over here guys see this is the vehicle oh, this is the tow truck um, oh shoot this is the tow truck um, business let me know in the comments if you guys want me to start like a series or like a like a gameplay roleplay on on the tow truck uh, business um, work showcase so yeah I will do it for you guys and I will live stream it if you guys want me to okay how do you oh I think you gotta touch the doors to make it open so yes guys over here this is where all the trucks goes and all the trucks and damaged cars goes I think yeah this is where all the trucks goes this is an awesome mod look at it guys so what I'm gonna do I'm gonna fly the drone and we're gonna go in and we'll look around the whole place so it looks like we got our own dock over here and we've got some we've got some homeless people over here not bad, not bad. He got his own fire and his own bed. Oh, nice, nice, nice. And uh, over here is the back door. Then over here is the there's another door over here to walk through here. And over here we've got the office. This is the receptionist office manager office or whatever you can, you can call it and over here is the staff room where the staff just have a coffee and heat up their coffees security area so yeah and over here we've got like a little resting area where the staff just comes over here rests and plays on the pool table this is nice this is nice I really like this mod man this mod is really freaking awesome so guys I hope you guys do like this mod okay because I certainly do but just to let you know that if you guys do get stuck installing this mod then please let me know in the comments below I'll be more than welcome to help you and just a reminder to make sure you download all the requirements that's in some of the description below and make sure it's the latest version and just another reminder to guys is to let me know in the comments if you guys want me to start a tow truck company business stream or video showcase okay so i can do it for you guys okay so with that said guys i hope you guys do enjoy this video if you guys did smash that like button and subscribe for more daily gaming content and i'll see you guys on my next video thank you for watching peace and i'm out